Hey, what's up, y'all? Welcome back to my channel. This is Too Much Hair. First, before we even get started, I need y'all to stop and subscribe and hit the notification bell. For some reason, YouTube is not letting my subscribers know that I'm uploading videos, so I just need you to take matters into your own hands and hit that bell. Well, we got Mari back today, and this is his second appointment where he didn't get his hair braided after his last appointment. So this is another five weeks. I don't know, this maybe have been six weeks. I think it was five weeks on the nose, but I know for a fact he got it braided after this appointment because I just saw him upload some pictures. I want to introduce two cameras. I am using my cell phone camera and I bought some Ray-Ban stories that have Bluetooth sunglasses with the video software cameras, Bluetooth. I can answer my phone from it. I love these sunglasses, but I don't think I wiped the lens off. I have to do an, more footage on my next video. This is what we got going on here. And I know you see it's kind of yellow. I had a few people ask me why it's so yellow from the last video. And yellow is pretty much just an indication of sebum. That's kind of what the color of your natural scalp oil looks like when it's caked up. Mari does have CARP, C-A-R-P, which is a skin condition. And it doesn't necessarily affect the hair. And you'll see when we get around to his forehead and stuff, you kind of see the discoloration on some of his skin. I'm not quite sure how it affects the scalp. It says it's not supposed to affect the scalp, but baby, I don't know what's going on here. Yeah, I love it. I'm in heaven. I'm, I'm in heaven. So I'm going to let y'all listen to a little bit of the sound. Then I'm going to come back every now and then and give you a few fun facts. Enjoy. Five and a half eight feel a baby there. Who is not going to get in there and have a problem? What's so crazy is it's just this cat. It looks clean, though. I mean, you know what I'm saying? It doesn't. That's just having it covered up the whole uh, time. Yeah. Ooh. I mean, it's on the one side. Mm -mm -mm. Good Lord. Yeah, I think I might need you to hold the camera because this is super a little bit extra. Nah, man, I was gonna go home, <laughs> y'all. <laughs> oh, why it's blurry? Oh, boy. I was about I did that, whatever it is, I did it. Mm -hmm. Okay. Against a piece. 30 seconds of footage. Mm -hmm. I don't really know which side the camera is on. I gotta figure that out. If you follow me on TikTok, you saw this uh, footage the other day. And if you don't follow me on TikTok, go ahead and follow me at Too Much Hair. Just getting out of here. I gotta go from here to here. I don't want to wet one side down now. It's coming down that color of itself. Always got to ask if it hurts because you just never know.
Did you see it? I do grow oil in there too. I smell it. That wild grow oil. Mm -hmm. So FYI, I do not recommend wild growth oil. Every day? How often do you Um, not every day, but. Some of you say you cringe when I don't remove the flakes from the hair, but I just kind of want you guys to understand that my main goal is to remove the flakes from the scalp. The flakes are going to be removed from the hair during the shampoo. I'll take care of that at the bowl. I'll call you back when I get done. Hold on, man. I'm gonna watch my video. Hello. Don't worry about it. Who? Trying to ignore me. Tell my baby I said bye. Tell my baby I said bye. Tell her I said that. That's enough to you. <laughs> Put that bottle down. It look like you on a marathon. All you need is a brown bag. Is it good? Let her, let, her, let her take a sip. Look at that.
We got some big chunks coming up and I was just enjoying all of this. I think I was getting distracted because I was watching how I was scratching while I'm editing and I'm like, what was I thinking? Plus, I don't know, his hair might be getting too thick. I don't know, something is going on, but bear with me. Just go back there and roll it up, man. Mm -mm, I roll it up. Mm -hmm. And he's talking about like, all the vegetables and herbs and stuff. So, like, he said, this right here help you. You know, you know, have syphilis if you take oh, this right here. Oh, oh, oh. I said, man. Look, so, they're just curing syphilis left and right in Jamaica. <laughs> I was like, yeah, they got all, they got every single medicine in their backyard. I Believe like, it if you want to. Nah, for real. I went on a, um, oh, he was for real. Like a little horse ride at one of the. The little, um, you know, the little fun places in Jamaica. I forgot the name of it, but uh, it's on TripAdvisor. But um, we took a horseback ride, and right there, like on our little ride through just through our little course, it was so many plants. Mm -hmm. And he stopped and showed us like what every plant was, and it was. I mean, you you'd be surprised at how much people know about the plants that's right next to them weeds and all of that and how valuable they are we don't know what anything is mm -hmm. it was called jam west in the grill that's like in them netflix series uh home girl she always out there in the garden she growing them she growing them um what is it called um uh, in the series you it was something mm -hmm. bangs like that. something you said that felt good mm -hmm. but um and they it'll kill you It'll kill you. Mm hmm The um uh, the plant. I can't think of the name of it. I'm gonna have to Google it. Yeah, he was on the video. He had like some spiritual Beep. he said this right here, if he can turn it upside down and it can stand up on its own, that's Beep. Right there, like a spiritual Beep. I was like, mm, oh, wow. That's it's, good to know when I go to He Jamaica. just made that up. No, I'm for yeah. real. Like he, he turned the plant upside and it was just standing up by itself. Right. But the root was like in the air, though. He had flipped it upside down. It was standing up. He been growing. He, he been having this for like 46 years. Dandruff is good. It's <laughs> like weed. It's from the earth. <laughs> nah. Mm, if you look at it like that, scalp is for earth. <laughs> well, that's actually a high thought, Makiba. You said that's a hot thought? A high thought. <laughs> Sorry, 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 sorry. <laughs> I'm like, something just popped me in my eye. It's so pretty. Why you got nice hair? It does have gorgeous hair. Oh, is this a voiceover? Yeah, it's probably gonna be a little music. Oh. Song. I gotta say, we just done told my boy whole name in here. Oh, they know. I be labeling them Mari this and Mari this. But not on um uh, the TT. Yeah, not not on none of what else is they Yeah. They different. <laughs> yeah, that's why the keys be at the look either. Mm-hmm. You know I'm trying to own TikTok. She own it. China. Like oh. The, the country. Hell, Look out, Summer. Yeah, no. She be dumb to even own something like that. Huh. That's like, you really Trump was trying to ban it because of that. I like ban it because it's corny to me. They were trying to ban it because China was making way too much money off of it. Yeah, they can take over. Yeah, they was like, oh, they got They got control over this generation. Like, what? Probably hacking into everybody's phone. Everybody, um, fifty percent of their car is good.
<laughs> you have a second one. Uh -huh. <laughs> it felt nice though. Ooh, okay. I think we need a new timer. So I used to, oh, you took your glasses off. Mm -hmm. I feel like that was probably making something happen too. Gotcha. I think everything's going better since I took my glasses off. Marnie just scheduled with you to get his ends trimmed. Mm hmm. You said his next one is going to be down? He said he going to get it braided. But still, whether he still need it trimmed. Trimmed and... What you getting? The little twist like you had, Mark? I'll probably get some braids. Some braids. Initial braids. Moment with the flat eyes. Why? Yo, what? Why do you need that? One minute with your flat eyes. You don't need that. Burning his hair out. You don't want to give it to him. <laughs> Go take it back. Exactly. Go get that one. That's because it was on the little sides when he go to sleep, the little ones that be over here. You know how it shrink up. Why are you throwing up game signs? Gotta straighten them out. Getting the full of how this looks. Hmm. Okay, so to you watching at home, don't try to detangle hair with this little bitty comb. Oh. Use use a larger comb if you're really detangling hair. This this you don't, you don't go through all this hair with this little bitty comb. Do most people that have that you know, or is it like short hair, long hair, or it just most of my clients that have um dandruff that have recordable dandruff? I have long hair. Mm -hmm. Their hair don't have no problem growing. Mm -hmm. And if their hair not long, it's because they don't want it to be long and they cut it. Mm -hmm. But yeah, everybody has um, all of my clients that have issues with, with excessive sebum have long hair. Mm-hmm. And full hair and thick hair. Do you want me to come in or is it back here? Um yeah, the fuss like that.
feel like I'm holding my breath because I don't want to be I'm breathing out. <laughs> 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 ah. Just don't say I feel like me. like it. Are you still up? Mm -hmm. Yeah, we've been asleep all day. Oh, I've been shaking it today. See, and I've been shaking it on the keyboard. Mm -hmm. People face is scrunched up right now trying to protect your mouth from these flakes. <laughs> Nothing is gonna jump through this screen, honey. <laughs>
about to corner this right side. I, it always throws my technique off. It always throws me off. I guess I'm trying not to hit my station and try to stay in frame, but it's something I always flip the comb and go in some crazy angle. Sorry about that. Absolutely nothing. I'm finding a new bike. They say it could be another month before you get your crap together, which is inexcusable. <laughs> I think I'm going to have to screenshot that one. So they done started almost trying to try to shadow ban me, I think, on YouTube. Because they the last video, that my people said they didn't even get the notification. Now, you could tell because it ain't even. It usually, my videos usually do like 30,000 views in the first day, at least two days. This one, it probably ain't even hit 30,000 views yet. Why, why, why they trying to ban you? What, you? what you done do? I don't know. Why do they do that? I don't know. I was mad too. Like, damn, I guess, I don't know. Maybe they ain't looking for, I don't know. Maybe that ain't a good search word no more or, I don't know. Did you Google, like, why was that? Did you Google that? Mm-mm. Nope. I, I kind of think the last video, I'm not quite sure, I think. I kind of think I changed my channel from, uh, a blog channel to a how-to channel. I think I did that. So if I did that, then that's exactly what I did wrong, and I need to change it back. I just this way. But I'm not sure. That's probably why. Yeah, I don't know that's if like I did from it a, though. From a gaming channel to a, a vlogging channel. Yeah, it's a big difference. Mm. And big difference on the the um the money too, and that's why I went with blogging when I went with blogging. And I'm kind of thinking like, why did I change to how to? Unless I uploaded that video as how to.
Oh, did I cross it to the camera? Yeah, right there. Okay. Okay. Mama think you can stop by TSU? Hmm? I said think you can stop by TSU. You can get what? I figured my, con I figured my controller. And wow. all the, them dirty clothes too? Yeah, mm -hmm. you can start. This, 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 I'm about to bust. So when you can ready, you can start getting, getting your stuff together. That was the only thing I forgot, literally. Yeah, if it wasn't for the controller, you wouldn't be trying to go back up there. Yeah, that's what, yeah, yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Do you have the key? I always got the key. Well, I can go up there. I'm not going Cause you know she gonna be looking. Dang, I man, I got all, I got, I got like eight Dutch packs in my. I got like a little, it's, it's, it's like a little book or whatever, but it's not pages in. It's like we can like hide stuff in it, but it looks like a like a big old dictionary. Got like eight packs in there. She is not gonna be opening up your books. I hope. Yeah. 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 I had to mute him a few times during this video because you know he gets excited and likes to tell me all his business. But y'all don't need to know all his business. <laughs> I'll be right back.
we got a new product coming in that you haven't made. I haven't made it yet. I'm going to make it. I'm not going to order it from nobody. I thought about having it manufactured and made, but I said, nah. I'm going to do it. That's thing. cap. I'm getting it manufactured. How do, you, how do you do that, like, manufacturing? Like, well, honestly, with something like that, I just have to get all the, the raw ingredients and figure out the measurements and then kind of test it to see how it kind of holds together if I need to put something else in it so it don't separate. Mm -hmm. And then I have to test it on people for a minute just to see how the, the, the um, ingredients do together. Then after that, I'll be ready to kind of put it out there if it does what I want it to do. But there are companies like shampoo companies and stuff that already make stuff and you just kind of have to tell them what you want in it, what color you want it to be, what it, you want it to smell like, what kind of bottles you want. And they take it from there. You know what, they, 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 get, they get a percentage and you get a percentage? Of course. So, um, I think that'll probably come later if I want it to come later. We'll see how long it takes for me to be whipping this stuff up on my own. How profitable it is. How much I'm going to have to make. You go to Africa, you go to Africa and advertise and be like... This could be tough straight hair. Mm -hmm. We can flaunt with Well, it ain't, no, nah, because mm -hmm. they straight hair is wigs. It ain't real hell. Mm -hmm. Plus, they be trying to know what to do for they presses and slip presses. It just don't work out. They don't have the right kind of products down there for that. You go, you go revolutionize on hair products down This ain't the product for that either, because mm -hmm. if it's manufactured in the U.S., it's going to cost a lot of money to go to Africa. And the dollar is already much more expensive in Africa, so it'll cost them much more mm -hmm. to send it there. That's why it's always cheaper to send stuff here from there. But it ain't really that cheap to send stuff there from here. It's a nice little ticket on that shipping. It's your face product. It's not a product for, um, you know, luxurious pressed out hair. Mm -hmm. It's a product for when this stand just start caking up. You can put something on your scalp and massage it in so it don't get hard. Or it dilutes it enough to where it's just not as strong. And you keep the skin lubricated so it don't um, keep on producing more of it. But that's just formulating a product. And they have... Um, I learned a lot about formulating through a podcast right. on uh, Apple Music. It was a whole formulating podcast. They did lotions. They did a whole lot of different kind of stuff and why to use a certain formulas, well, a certain formulas, and what's what do you use to stabilize it? What do you use to keep it longer on the shelf? Why would you use this over that? Who's more allergic to this than that? Because some products are, some ingredients are really, really good for whatever you use them for, but it's they're also got a lot of people allergic to that one particular ingredient. Mm -hmm. So it's like, do you want to use that or something like that? If you use that, of course it'll work better, but it'll limit your market significantly. So people be wanting as many people in their market as possible. But they won't use a product that's as good as it could be. You want the cone here earlier? Oh my God. Yes, fine. Mm -hmm. I got a um, small cone with the chicken tenders and the, the 24K sauce on it. With a side of mac and cheese and <laughs> pineapple coleslaw. It was all the flavors you needed. Yes. So do you hold the cone and eat them from the cone? Yeah, I, I hold one. I, I get I get down in there. They need to they need to put a location downtown on by Broadway. That's like that's gonna make some money down there. Okay, so Coneheads is yeah. a restaurant near the shop. It's a fairly new restaurant in Nashville, and they serve popcorn chicken inside waffle cones with different kind of sauces and stuff so 
Um, he loves it. I've only eaten there a few times, but I think I need to go back and try it again. One of my friends, he got wigs. I'm like, man. Yeah. 15 weeks? We just gonna be bantu nuts. Yeah. I like some that you have in the county. Like, hey, one, one, one hair for you. I don't know, like one hairstyle. This, this is what they put, this is what they give you. With all the scratching and the shampooing and the treatments, it still flakes. When the scalp dries up, it still dries up flaky. And you can see his scalp was kind of red too. He said it wasn't irritating and it didn't hurt, but the scalp, trust me, has already started producing sebum. So by the time he leaves out of the salon, it's already got that first layer of oil coming back up. Thank you again for your view. Please follow me on TikTok and don't forget to subscribe. Tap, 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 ponytail, ponytail again, ponytail again.